Hi, I'm Dick Rathmeyer, uh, CEO of Penn's Woods uh, Jersey Shore State Bank. Uh, what we did here is we uh, rebuilt our boardroom. Uh, we took a uh, very open uh, space here. Uh, it was unutilized and we needed to utilize it. And we had a fair amount of issues because of the sunlight and we have uh, uh, a lot of open space. And in this process, we had to find a solution to still keep the open architecture, keep our modern design, and find a way that we could protect it from the sun and, and, the, and the elements and make it a usable space. Uh, the solution wasn't quite as simple as we thought it would be, uh, but when we looked at this and we found only really one provider that, uh, that uh, satisfied us, and uh, we believe this solution is much, uh, much better, it's a much better solution than we ever thought we'd get. Uh, we had some options that weren't very good options, whether it was to put some kind of filament over the windows, uh, but quite frankly, this was an effective cost solution, and uh, everyone talks about it, and uh, we're just extremely happy that the product's a top-notch product. The service was great, and even though it was a very unusual installation, uh, it got done in a high-quality way. So they were cost-effective, so maybe we should have charged more. Yeah, yeah, maybe not. <laughs> I didn't say cheap. <laughs> and, and what's been the, the reaction from your board and others? In the... Yeah, that's really one of the neat parts, because like I say, we do have a very modern open architecture, and to uh, add a unique table like we did and some cabinetry. It really compliments it. And the board members and all our guests just love to see it work. And, uh, but again, it's such a good solution. It almost goes unnoticed after a while, which it should. But everyone for the first time when they see it, it's like, wow, because, because they're mechanical and uh, they're designed and they can, you can open different rows. Uh, so that they're all impressed. They're actually probably impressed that they've never seen like it. And then we have uh, the other shades for interior windows. So if there is a little sun, they've got the options of closing mm -hmm. here or closing there. So. Well, the, the, they almost go unnoticed because everyone's so infatuated with the, yeah. uh, with the overhead shades and uh, it's for good reason. Yeah, yeah. So they should. So it feels pretty cool in here having worked in here a little bit. It got pretty warm. Yeah. The functionality is amazing. First of all, glare. Secondly, it was a heat issue. We had trouble cooling this space. Uh, since then, now we have people complaining just a little too hard. <laughs> so it, it really, really did its job. And uh, like I say, we would, uh, we were, it's well beyond our expectations. That's great. And the glare, that's a, a big part of the use of light shows, which is effectively what these are, is that glare reduction. It does have a pretty uh, cool light. Yeah, I think what else was helpful to pick the right uh, amount of shading. And when you went through the process with us, uh, we were able to test it. And we had, we had three options uh, as far as density. And making that uh, choice uh, was really, really difficult. But we took two or three weeks to do that. And the reason we took two or three weeks is we wanted to get it right. And, and I think your, your suggestion was go a little darker than, than not. And uh, that really was, uh, was, was a good suggestion for us. If it's too see-through, the openness factor is too much, you, you get a little bit too much glare just through. Anything you would change? I don't think we would. We're so enamored by it and it's so functional and it provided a solution that we were concerned that we would even get a solution for it to be acceptable from an architectural perspective and a functionality. So, now we're really satisfied at this point. That's really awesome. So I'm just going to leave it right there. Thank you. Thank you.